Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to learn how to convert cubic feet on a semi-trailer to feet. Now, the thing about cubic feet and feet is they're different dimensions. A cubic foot measures three dimensions of linear feet, and feet can measure one dimension, two dimensions, three dimensions, so it all depends. Now, generally, a semi-trailer is much longer than it is tall or wide, and a cubic foot measures all three of those dimensions, length, width, and height. So let's say they said a semi-trailer has a volume of 2,400 cubic feet, which we write as feet cubed. Uh, well, the 2,400 would be length times width times height. And again, this looks much longer. This is going to be the, generally the narrowest because it's got to fit in traffic. And then it can't be that high because it's got to get under bridges. So maybe we'll say it's 40 long. It's about 6 wide this way. And then it's about 10 high. So in general, you'd have to guess because you can't exactly tell what the dimensions are going to be from the cubic feet. We could break down 2400 plenty of other ways. We could say it was 240 times 10 times 1, but that doesn't look realistic. It doesn't look like it's 240 feet long and only 10 wide and only 1 high. It looks more like it's 40 by 6 by 10. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned how to convert cubic feet on a semi-trailer to feet. Thanks a lot.